Well, PennDOT is taking steps to see what repairs are needed to a historic covered bridge in Lancaster County. This after a truck got stuck passing through it. Evan Papalis joins us live in West Earl Township with the latest on this story. Good afternoon to you, Evan. Good afternoon, James. The Bitzer Mill covered bridge is now temporarily closed following an accident involving a tractor trailer yesterday morning at around 9 a.m. West Earl Township police were called out here in the morning that at that 9 a.m. spot when the big rig got stuck. The bridge shows a height limit of 10 feet 6 inches. However, the truck is 13 feet and 4 inches. The bridge was built in 1846 and is the oldest covered bridge still in use in Lancaster County. But PennDOT says after the accident, it had to shut the bridge down in order to get a sense of how bad the damage is and then figure out what happens next. So right now we're assessing the damage and, and, and coming, trying to come up with a, a repair plan, uh, kind of assessing uh, what the, the repairs will be and, and actually who will do it. It, it, it might be our county maintenance uh, folks that do that, but, but that's, that's to be determined. And David Thompson there with PennDOT says he doesn't know when that repair plan will be put together, but I'll have more tonight at five detailing more of the events that took place here yesterday morning and how it all could have been avoided. James and Evan, once that plan is finally finalized for repairing it, do we know how long the actual physical repairs would take? Yeah, David Thompson with PennDOT still still saying that you know this is fresh it's just yesterday he has a bunch of professionals coming out checking out this bridge saying once that plan is put into place it could be several weeks depending on what is determined that needs to be fixed but if it's a lot of structural damage it could be several months right now in western old township evan Palace, abc 27 news and also evan behind you there over your shoulder i can see a sign on that bridge saying you know the height limit do we know if the driver of that truck is facing any charges Yes, we just did talk with the police chief a couple minutes ago before we went live out here in the rain. Good rain to have. But he says there are multiple charges that could be coming forth. Didn't really get into what those could be, but it all seems like those would be more of a fine, a monetary value. So almost three feet over what the height is allowed. So, you know, you see that there and just wonder why. Uh, just missing the signs. That's what the driver said. He said he didn't see the signs. Gotcha. All right, Evan, get inside before the rain gets even worse. Thank you very much. Live for us there in Lancaster County. Okay.